everyone, welcome to New eLearning. This is Li Tong, your New Skin Singapore Pharmanex product trainer. Today, let's learn together on the topic of probiotics and gut health. First of all, what is gut health? Gut, okay, also referred to the gastrointestinal system, gastrointestinal tract, digestive system, or digestive tract. It is basically a group of organs that include your mouth, esophagus, stomach, pancreas, liver, gallbladder, small intestines, large intestine, and anus. It's where food digestion and absorption take place. The term gut health has been increasingly used in the public, medical, and also the food industry. But from a scientific point of view, it is still unclear exactly what gut health is, how it can be defined, and how it can be measured. According to a third-party researcher, Bischoff, this, these are five major criteria have been defined that might form the basis for a more objective definition of gut health. It is established by a scientific committee working on gut health issues. Gut health can be defined as how effective digestion and absorption of food is. Um, the absence of gastrointestinal, also known as GI diseases, normal and stable intestinal microbiota, effective GI barrier function, and the status of well-being and normal quality of life. There are two particularly significant aspects to determine gut health, which are our GI microbiota and our GI barrier. What is GI barrier? It is a barrier lying in your gut tract that separates the inside of the body from the outside environment. GI barrier composed of the intrinsic barrier, which consists of epithelial cells and tight junctions that tie them together. The extrinsic barrier, which consists of secretions and other influences, including your mucus, cytokines, antimicrobiota um, peptides, and also antibodies that help to maintain the barrier functions. This GI barrier ensures undesirable luminal contents to be contained within the intestinal lumen while ensuring nutrients being absorbed into the body. Any impairment of this GI barrier can increase the risk of developing infectious, inflammatory and functional GI health issues. GI microbiota is what we are going to learn more about today. GI microbiota refers to the collection of microorganisms colonizing the GI tract, including bacteria, archaea and eukaryotes. There are 400 million different bacterial species in our bodies. Most of them are in our GI tract. This microbiota offers many benefits to our bodies, including strengthening gut in integrity, protecting against pathogens, and supporting immune response. 70% of human immune system is localized in the digestive tract. If a healthy gut, uh, gut microbiota is disturbed, immune system can easily be compromised as well. What can disrupt our GI microbiota? In fact, before we are born, maternal, vaginal, and intestinal microbiota can already affect the GI microbiota of the fetus. Of course, unhealthy diet such as diet high in deep fried food and low in dietary fiber can also upset your GI microbiota. And medications from the therapeutic treatments, hygiene levels, and GI disorders can also affect gut microbiota. Recognizing the importance of health, healthy gut microbiota, Incorporating probiotics are part, uh, as part of our diet is encouraged. What are probiotics? They are basically good living bacteria or yeast that are naturally found in our body. In recent decades, a growing body of scientific evidence suggests that the consumption of probiotics from foods and supplements help support gut health. Food sources of probiotics are mainly fermented foods, uh, which include yogurt, socrat, miso, cheese, kombucha, and tempeh. Apart from that, it is also becoming more common that nowadays many of us are taking probiotic supplements. We are going to learn more about ProBio today, well, our Pharmanex probiotic supplement, which is also known as our ProBio PCC, which contains a potent probiotic bacterial culture of Lactobacillus fermentum PCC, proven to survive gastric acid and effectively colonize in the gut. What is so unique about our ProBio PCC? 
A good probiotic product should contain adequate amount of live microorganisms in order to provide intended health benefits. The scientific and analytical methods used in development of probiopsisi ensures product to contain at least 1.5 billion CFUs per serving at the end of shelf life. Another interesting point is the strain of probiotic Probiotics Lactobacillus fermentum PCC was found isolated from a Swedish woman who showed an extraordinary resilience to undesirable organisms. Next, let's learn about the selection of strain. Probio PCC is developed by the following by following the probiotic guidelines established by FAO, WHO expert consultation for pH survival, colonization, identity, and dosing. Our stomach is an acidic environment. Probiotic needs to have strong pH survival in order to survive and colonize at the lower part of GI tract. Probiotics should also have the capability to proliferate and colonize the gut and be able to grow in the presence of bowel under conditions in the intestines. Probiotics must also be able to assert their benefits on the host through growth and also activity in the human body. Regarding identity, the identity of strain according to the International Code of Nomenclature and the viable concentration of each probiotic at the end of shelf life should be stated on the label. The product must also indicate the dosage regimens and also duration of use as recommended by the manufacturer and should be based on scientific evidence. Probiotics should be ingested regularly for the health-promoting properties to persist. Probiol PCC's benefits include encouraging the proliferation and healthy live probiotic bacteria in the lower digestive tract, acting as a friendly tenant to reduce the symptoms commonly associated with occasional GI discomfort, fortifying the natural digestive defense system and assisting the absorption of key nutrients. At the same time, it helps support healthy function of the urinary tract. Now, who should use probio PCC? If you experience occasional gastrointestinal discomfort, you may use probio PCC. Probio PCC lactobacillus fermentum may be able to help relieve symptoms associated with GI discomfort, occasional bowel irregularity, diarrhea, and other common digestive and non-digestive discomforts. For those who travel frequently, you shall also use probiol PCC as well to support your natural digestive immune response. To get those benefits that I mentioned just now, um, you shall just follow the recommended, recommended use which is to take it one capsule daily with food. Next up, let's look into some frequently asked questions. Hmm, how does probiol PCC work? Well, probiol PCC unique strain of friendly ba uh, bacteria like Lactobacillus fermentum PCC can effectively colonize in the lower digestive tract. Hence, it helps discourage the development of undesirable microorganisms. Regarding the safety of probiol PCC, it is safe and well tolerated at the recommended dosage. The family of Lactobacillus has a long history of use as probiotics without established risk to humans, which remains the best proof of safety. Apart from that, New Skin does monitor pro product safety and every single batch of, by performing safety testing as well. However, if you are pregnant or lactating or taking a pres prescribed medication, please do consult a physician prior to use. Next question, is probio PCC required to be refrigerated? Um, probio comes in dual layer plastic bottle packaging, which provides protection against environmental exposure. Thus, ensuring better stability of the probio PCC throughout the shelf life. Probio does not require to be refrigerated. However, it is recommended to be kept in a refrigerator after opening to maintain a higher level of organisms throughout the shelf life. Next question. Um, are there scientific studies validating probio PCC? The primary goal of probiotic therapeutic, uh, therapy is to help establish the natural balance of intestinal microbiota in order to have an optimal functioning digestive defense system. This effect is well established in independently published research. The health benefits of lactobacillus fermentum PCC 
are also supported by a total of 12 clinical studies and 16 animal in vitro studies. Here we come to the end of our session. To wrap up, ProBio PCC contains a potent probiotic bacterial culture of lactobacillus fermentum. It is especially recommended for those who experience occasional GI discomfort and frequent traveler. ProBio PCC helps to relieve symptoms associated with occasional gastrointestinal discomfort, occasional bowel irregularity, diarrhea, and other common digestive and non-digestive discomforts. Hope you enjoyed the content today. I'll see you next time.